four X. Gabe Diamond. Uh, X, can you tell us kind of what what coach wanted you to do on that last possession? I mean, he, he said he wanted to get the ball down to Tillman, but what were her, his instructions to you? Honestly, it was a whole different play set up. But once we kind of like, we kind of hesitated at like bringing the ball down. And after we almost got the backcourt call, I just had to take off and try to create something. So, I mean, just a basketball play and a nice finish by Teal. Andy Humphrey. Yeah, X. Uh, when they, you know, you know, with the way that they defended the paint tonight and kind of disrupted some of the transition game, how'd y'all try to adjust to that? Um, I mean, we just tried to keep attacking, keep attacking, and see what will open up. I mean, they played, they did a really good job guarding all of our plays, all of our sets. We just had to get our feedback under us and try our best to keep playing as hard as we could. Colin? Hey, X, that last media timeout with 3.30 left, what was the message in the huddle and how did you guys mentally lock in for that last stretch and, and close the game? The message was clearly, I mean, we've been here before <laughs> a lot of times, a lot of times, whether it was last year or my freshman year. So, I mean, we've been in those situations before and now that we have the experienced team that we have and that we work on it so hard in practice, I feel like we just put it all together and, and let go aside everything, put aside everything we needed to and focus on whatever was going to get us that victory. Dave Matter? X, when, when Jeremiah had to hit the free throw, did you say anything to him or did you leave him alone at that point? How do you I mean, him? coach normally tell us to leave him alone, but I just had to tell him he had to make it. <laughs> like, he had to make that one. <laughs> Mason? Hey, X. So, how does this game where you face Wadham and Wow, prepare you for the conference game starting up next? Say it again. Sorry. Yeah, Mason. How does this game where you face Wadham and Wow, prepare you for the conference game start next? I get it. I got it. Um, I feel like, I mean, that was a tough game. We had a 10-day layoff, so I feel like for us to come back in and be tested, battle-tested like that, and still trying to get our legs back under us and still try to get back in the flow of our pace, our normal pace. I feel like that prepared us really well to go right into conference and, of course, play Tennessee next. Colin? Yeah, ex coach said he wished you guys maybe would have scrimmaged a little more in the lead up to this game. How do you feel like the layoff affected you guys? Do you feel like it affected you guys or was it just Bradley? I mean, I mean, you can't take away the good job that Bradley did, but I mean, the layout for us, it was it was kind of long, uh, but I mean we did we still worked hard we still put in the work we still you know came in the gym and worked out and got the proper rest so there's no excuses to be made but I feel like I mean it Bradley did a great job defending and trying to punch us on offense and we also did a good job with with digging deep and giving whatever we had left in the tank to win. Dave Matter. X, you guys have been able to survive nights. Some of the other guards aren't shooting very well. What's it say about this group having off type of you and Mark and, and still come through? I mean, it just, like I said before, it just shows the growth. I mean, if one thing is not working, that don't affect the whole game. Like, I mean, for instance, if my shot is not working, that that's that's an opportunity for me to show my defense. I feel like you got you to gotta figure out a way to do something to help the team, I feel like, and that's what – Everyone on the team's focus is, and I mean that's how we that's how we approach every game. Gabe. Yeah, Tillman said coach made it obvious to him that he was not playing hard enough at halftime, and there's been a couple stretches this year where he seems like a guy that kind of flip can flip a switch and take over. I mean, do you guys, you know, do you notice that? Do you say anything to him, and and what kind of flips that switch for? I mean, his will to win. I feel like. I mean, as you see today, I mean, like, everybody's not going to start off how they want to. It's about how you finish, I feel like. And no matter how he how he started off, I should say, you see the finish that he made. I mean, he got the end one, and he made the game win the free throw. So I feel like, I mean, with Till, he just knows when his team, when, when, when we need him, we need him. So he has to come through. So I feel like today he just came through for us. 
All right, X, Merry Christmas. Thank you, guys. Merry Christmas to you, too.